January 22nd, 2020. It is official. The Raiders are now the Las Vegas Raiders. Cassie Soto, Mick Akers here of the Las Vegas Review Journal. Mick, the announcement was officially made. Before we get into it, let's hear from the Raiders themselves. Their thoughts on now being called the Las Vegas Raiders. Sounds great, man. You know, uh, we had some great memories in Oakland. Uh, wish we could have brought that city a championship, but looks like we're going to have to do it here, man, because this this uh, this welcome was was special, I think, for our owner. I think it was special for our team, uh, special for the guys that were here. You know, when, when we went up there to stake our you know, claim here, uh, the, the reception that we got was overwhelming. It was really awesome. It's, it's exciting. It's exciting to be here, um, to be able to you know start with the kids yesterday and to tour the facility, uh, practice facility in the stadium now and to have this, uh, it's been a pretty great few days. So uh, it's an exciting time for the city, uh, for the players, everyone involved. So uh, we're looking forward to it. It feels really good. I'm gonna have to get my family all new gear. Um, <laughs> no, but it's awesome. It's a uh, really exciting time just to be here. And uh, there's so much energy going into this. And you know, you can just see um, the effect that we're having uh, already. Um, just hopefully keep making an effect on the community and um, win some games here and, and be really excited. All right, the announcement was made again January 22nd, Las Vegas Raiders. How soon, Mick, can people get their hands on some Raiders gear? Yeah, in a few months, uh, Mark Bedane said they'll start selling the merchandise at the 2020 NFL Draft, which is here in Las Vegas. So, you know, take advantage of you know, all the crowd being here, maybe get some new fans on board with Las Vegas. So uh, April is going to be the first time you can get the official Las Vegas merchandise. I know there was some speculation of what today's meeting was going to be because we had thought that the name change couldn't be official until March. What do you think made it happen January 22nd? Well, that's what everyone thought because that's when the new league year um, happens it's in March so everyone was just kind of waiting for that but uh, Mark Bedane said they can do it whenever they want he told us that back um, in the end of December so it's they're just kind of waiting for the right time I think with the draft announcement and then maybe picking that time to start selling the merchandise I think it's kind of worked uh, pretty well together yeah well what do we think happens now obviously we saw Derek Carr Darren Waller here are these guys buying houses now they're moving in it's, it's official they don't have to keep it a secret anymore Right, yeah, I, I would. Assume they're already being you know, here a lot. Um, I know the guys are doing a appearance this weekend at yeah. one of the Ford dealerships. So you know they're making the rounds already, feeding kids at school this past week. So yeah, a lot of them are already staking their claims. They got homes here, some are getting built here. So you know they're getting ready to come down here, but they still have some stuff to do in Oakland, some of the off-season stuff, um, training camps in Napa. So. You know, they'll be here, but they, you know, fully won't be until the summertime. Yeah. Well, don't let it overshadow this announcement. Let it overshadow that the Raiders are donating $500,000, Mick, to basically eliminate lunch debt for local kids here in Las Vegas. That's incredible. Yeah, that, you know, as they've been doing ever since they even announced that they were going to come here a few years back, they've been, you know, been around the community a lot. So um, this is obviously a big deal to, like, a, a lot of kids, you know, that have issues paying for breakfast and lunch and all that, so they rack up bills that, it, you know, they can't afford it. So obviously that's a big chunk, you know, to take that, you know, debt away from those kids, which, you know, shouldn't have in the first place. Yeah. All right, well, once again, it is official. We can start calling them the Las Vegas Raiders, January 22nd, 2020. For Mick Akers, I'm Cassie Soto. Thanks for watching. Stay with us, Vegas Nation, as we bring you all the latest Las Vegas Raiders updates.